Good morning, Oil City. Today is Tuesday, October 6th, B-Day, and these are your morning announcements. Show off your summer in the yearbook. We are looking for summer pictures to feature in the 2021 oil can. Be sure to include some background information about the photo. Email your photos to emmertejan at mmcbride at student.ocasd.org or tejan at tejanplum at student.ocasd.org. The Haunted Hayride will take place on October 16th and 17th at dusk. This event takes place at Furtick's Community Center and is free for anyone who wants to ride. Oil City Senior High School will be holding a virtual talent show. The form to enter has been emailed to each grade and staff. Please check your email and participate. The deadline to enter is October 14th. Contact Mr. Black if you have any questions. You don't have to sacrifice your individuality for the military. Whether it's video games, whether you're writing poetry or writing music, maybe you're a professional runner. I think every community is different in its own way. I was actually a certified fitness instructor through CNRC. They sent me to school to be an aerobic dance instructor. We learn about nutrition, everything that has to do with what we're teaching, and then we do our classes. I've also done Lean Six Sigma, which is huge in the civilian sector. I've been able to put a whole program together. This is what a bad oil sample would actually look like. So you could actually like smell a little bit. You know, I always give it a little like, little taste. I just met some of the guys, there's actually some pancake syrup. <laughs> the Navy doesn't ask you not to be who you are. The Navy wants you to be who you are. We do like talent shows. The karaoke thing was a really big one. We had a lot of people that had like guitars and stuff. You know, some of the junior enlisted, some of the officers would hang out and play guitar for everybody. I write poetry. I don't really feel like it's a talent. It's just something I do to keep my mind at ease. I got to read the poem in front of everybody. I wasn't like too sure of myself because that's just something I do in my spare time. But it, it let me know like, oh, like these are my, this is my family now. Like they support me. They want to see me do good. They want to hear more poetry. In the community of the Navy, we love to see sailors doing what they're passionate about and what they love. We are big supporters of each other. We had a lot of people come out to interact and mix and mingle and have community time together. You have so many people from so many different walks of life, all with the same aspiration to just better themselves for themselves, for their country, for their family, you know, whether it be through education, whether it be through learning a trade or a craft. This is how we become a better, stronger Navy to do what it is that we came here to do. Here are the athletic events for the week. Here is the lunch menu for this month. Please stand for a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.